Pioneers made one last change right before tip-off. They brought in Roscoe Eastman. The three. It was maybe one of the worst games the Pioneers had played, Greg. And that's going to be an easy bucket there by Philip Robrach. Towns is going to hesitate. Nice give off right there. And Inzaquazi gets stuffed. Or three Pioneers. 13-34 to go. Adam Bowers is going to let go. That one's going to be no good. But the freshman comes up and slams it down. Allen Eikens. Back to Air Force a year ago, too, on the road. I mean, was just had a terrific game. Brown's going to let it go from the corner. And Brown takes the pass. The Panom into the corner now, dumps into Robracha. Robracha is going to kick it back out. Panom going to fire from three. Got it. And that's what Paul Sather likes about Panom. Walter's going to cast off from three. That one's going to not even draw the rim, but it bounces right back to him. Shot clock's going to be at two. And that's the killer right there. Marlon Stewart had an open look. And taking advantage of his athleticism. As bad as the Pioneers have played, it's only a nine point deficit. But Stewart's going to get an and one going to the rack. A day Murky fell down, but Stewart with a good line over to Brown. Brown struggles from three, but not good positioning by the freshman. Robracci gets a couple of rebounds, gets the reverse to go. Stewart is a magic man with the ball in his hands. Dump inside, and there you see the freshman's going to get an easy lay-in. Allen Eikens, 41-34. Murky leaves his feet, and look at the freshman take it all the way in. Allen Eikens is a good-looking freshman. This is the one I believe that they're going to have to kind of hang their hat on. Oh, and from the corner, Walter saw him do this against Oregon State. Stewart goes inside, and a great look, and converting is Urban Avicius. Kernaz down in the blocks. Alps going to reverse it back out to Eastman, let it go from three. And Eastman starting to feel it a little bit. And right now, Marlon Stewart's out of the game. The opportunity for the Pioneers here, but a great job there by Bintu Panoam that gets it in. I think Paul Sather wanted to give Stewart a breather. He's only got one foul. You'll see him for the duration. Oh, and a three-pointer. You don't need much. It's a one-point game at 58-57. Pioneers on a roll, but the freshman takes it the other way. And Deshaun Allen Eikens. We saw that three earlier when I was critical of him, and again, not a good attempt, and there's what happens. Yep, Walters come back, and Walter buries it. On, Ball bro. rotation. That one off the rim, no good. The offensive board comes back to North Dakota. As Brown had missed it. Stewart, nothing but the bottom of the net. Senior point guard. He knew that one was big, too. It was a one-point game. Got a little bit too in a hurry. Stewart's going to put a circus shot off the window. And again, the Pioneers were right there. They're going to count that. It's a block foul, and that's a good call. Therefore, slow defensively, and it cost Denver a basket. And right there, addition to him, and Gatlin's going to let it go from the baseline, and that's good, and that's a three. Gatlin on Stewart. Stewart, Danielson now back to Stewart with a crossover. He's got a step. Ends a crazy, gets it. He takes it all the way in and gets it to go. You go with your senior leader. The senior guard, Marlon Stewart, when you find trouble, you go to your veteran leader. They did it. As he dribbles out the clock, that'll do it. North Dakota comes away 82-71 winners over the DU Pioneers.